do anything if that's what they love doing. Like my sister is a huge rugby and football fan and they're normally considered with oh only men and boys who can play football and rugby. But there's so many girls out there who love football and rugby and there's so many men out there who love dancing and ballet. There's no it's, it's not there shouldn't be a stereotype that girls have to do ballet and boys have to do rugby. It should be everyone's doing it all if that's what they want to do. I mean everyone has probably done some sort of dancing to some sort of music in any part of their life. Like my nan has and the president probably has and the queens probably has. But there shouldn't be a stereo there shouldn't be like girls are more that better dancers than men, men are better rugby players than girls. It should be if you enjoy doing it, you should do it and you shouldn't care what anyone else thinks. And to see all all these chairs filled, it it just gives you like a sense a sense of um like specialty, like um, you've been chosen out of 400 people to do the show, and now you're performing it. And when the lights go down, you can just about see the front row, but then you're so so into the actual act that um, you, f you forget that um, there's people here, it feels like a little dress rehearsal. After this, it's, it's changed what I want to do, because I I never used to know what I wanted to do and just performing on the stage has made me think I want to do something just performing whether it's dancing or acting it's just I, I feel that it, it's, it's pushed me in a direction it's, it's helped me find my path I think I'll take away a bit more confidence in myself because I, I never used to be a confidence person. I I always used to be the one who would thought oh, I'll just I'll just be in the background, but it's just after performing it, you really you really should try your hardest and everything, and that's that's made me think as well with, with about confidence of just taking on anything because you never know where they might lead you. I just think that's, that's the best thing that has happened to me that I've built more confidence in myself. I felt really, really upset on the last show. It was a, it, the last show was by far the best show we did, but it was really upsetting to say goodbye to everyone because we spent two months nearly every day with each other. And it's just like saying goodbye to your family because we got so close to each other and we knew everything about each other and all. And it's just like, you wouldn't really expect a like, like it's been so high and so like intense. intense for so long, and then it's just dropped and back to normal now. And it's, it's, it's it was a pleasure to be chosen, but it's, it's, it's like disappointing now it's ended. But it was, it was good, really good.